Arizona is divided into three distinct geographic provinces, the Colorado Plateau, the Transition Zone, and the Basin and Range. Characterized by mesas, the Colorado Plateau is a region of high elevation that slices through Arizona northwest to southeast, forming its northeastern border and extends into Utah, New Mexico, and Colorado. Geologically, the Colorado Plateau is composed of many layers of mostly flat-lying sedimentary rocks. These layers largely consist of limestone and sandstone sequences indicative of transgressing and regressing shallow seas. After more than 300 million years of deposition from these shallow seas, the Laramide orogeny uplifted a large area of continental crust giving the plateau its high elevation. These sedimentary layers are beautifully shown in the Grand Canyon and the mesas of Monument Valley. Much later, these sedimentary layers were overlain with relatively young volcanic activity. The most prestigious of these volcanic fields is the San Francisco Volcanic Field near Flagstaff, Arizona. The Colorado Plateau is host to a variety of landscapes. In the colorful badlands of the Painted Desert, Petrified Forest National Park is an amazing collection of 200 million year old petrified wood. The geologically young volcanic fields just north of Flagstaff are remnants of a more violent time in Arizona's history. Just east of there, Meteor Crater boasts one of the most pristine impact craters. The sandstone buttes of Monument Valley create an iconic landscape shaped by erosion. Of course, the most famous feature of the Colorado Plateau is the awe-inspiring Grand Canyon. The climate of the Colorado Plateau varies greatly due to extreme changes in elevation. However, temperatures are much cooler than the low deserts of the Basin and Range Province. Aside from the monsoons of late summer and early autumn, the Colorado Plateau is an extremely arid region, receiving less than 10 inches of precipitation annually in the mid to lower elevations. A large majority of the region is dominated by grassland and sagebrush. Most of the forests of the Colorado Plateau reside in the higher elevations near Flagstaff. Typical flora of these forests are the ponderosa pine and douglas fir. The pinyon pine, juniper trees, and a variety of cacti dot the landscape of the mid to lower elevations. The sedimentary layers of the Colorado Plateau are dotted with coal, uranium, and other hard rock mineral deposits. Copper and gold were some of the first minerals to be mined extensively on the plateau, while the development of nuclear weapons increased the level of uranium prospecting and mining throughout the region. Today, the Navajo power plant near Page features three 750 megawatt coal fueled steam electric generating units. Water remains the most vital resource of the Southwest, and the Colorado River is arguably the most important water resource in Arizona. In an effort to control this resource, dams such as the Glen Canyon Dam and the Hoover Dam were constructed on the Colorado River in order to control floods, provide irrigation water, and produce hydroelectric power. The combination of a rich geologic history, inspiring landscapes, and important water and energy resources make the Colorado Plateau a truly special place in the American Southwest. <laughs>